Good day guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my last video, I talked about drilling down into pivot table in order to see the summarized details of each item type from the pivot table summarized section by drilling down those summarized data. Today, we are moving into another feature of Microsoft Z pivot table called pivot chart. Right, right here before me, I got a pivot table which we have been able to summarize from a large set of data, right from over 10,000 data lists, which we have been able to summarize down into rows, label, column labels, in order to build this pivot table in the in the cross sections. However, I want to perform something more virtual. That is, I want to see a chart based on this data here. Basically, included in in Microsoft Excel Pivot Table, there is what is called Pivot Chart. This is a very simple tool to so standard Excel chart with one big difference. Take a look on how to create a pivot chart based on summarized data in the pivot table all right the first step is to select anywhere on the wall, on the pivot table so i can select anywhere here now go to analyze tab you can see under the what the pivot table tools tab here all right at the right hand side here there is a section called tools you can see tools and one of the tools is a pivot chart all right then so click on it so once you click on it it display different different type of pivot chart you want right so right here i'm going to to stick with the the default the default chart which is the typical common type of chart most people work with all right so now select have selected it then click on what okay now i got my chart based on the pivot table really simple let me drag it down 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 okay good all right so you can see that i have my pivot table chart based on the word the summarized pivot table data list the the charts um, the chart layer low clock star um okay i might decide to remove something on the let me try to remove something on the other on the field here maybe okay let me remove the word the country to see okay good you can see i have a better look of a chart here all right so this is very simple just click on just click on your pivot table over to down to your what over down to your analyze tab here at the top of your screen click on pivot chart then pick the type of chart you want and you are good to go however the one big difference between a pivot chart and a standard excel chart you find inside the insert tab is that the pivot chart is still connected to to the pivot table which means anything that changes in the structuralized pivot table also changes within the word chart here all right okay take a look on the on the practical aspect i'm going to perform here okay let me try to bring back a country here okay you can see you can see that in the uh, in the chart here 
it, it, it changes as I'm changing the word the field on the word on the interface here so as long as the pivot table changes it will definitely what update it itself just click and drag your chart your chart will definitely changes because they are connected it is very quick and simple with a very die with a very dynamic robust report you can you find here so you can just create you can create a purple chart just by create just by click on the word the interface of the word purple chart then click on the one click on the pivot table then go to your analyze tab then create a chart you can try to mess around with what with the layout here of your chart on your of your pivot table and confirm that your chart updates as you keep changing the board to your pivot table summary thank you and don't forget to some to subscribe to my youtube channel as i'll keep giving you more of the updated exam functions bye